Cruising in the Brick are corridor-style co-ed residence halls. Both buildings have common spaces for residents, full kitchens, a laundry room, and stall bathrooms on each floor. The Brick also has a lawn where students can hang out and get some fresh air. Cruisin is a first-year dorm that is gendered by floor and has common areas on the first and ground floor. On the first floor, you will find the main entrance, a meeting area, and a gender-neutral bathroom. On the ground floor, you'll find vending machines, another meeting area, and a kitchen. Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, my name is Michael Bradley. I'm an RA here in Cruzen. Uh, I just wanted to bring you guys in and show you that this is a standard room here in Cruzen. So over here we have two different, uh, two different sets of drawers, one for each roommate. Now currently I only have one bed in here, being an RA, so I have mine set up this way. I've got my desk set up for a little bit of online learning. Hopefully we'll be mostly in person coming up here soon. So this is your typical setup. Normally you would have two beds, they'd be arranged differently, but that would allow you to be able to move around your, uh, your room space. Welcome to the brick. This is your standard double room. Uh, as you can see, it's got a ton of room for you and your roommate. Uh, this is on the third floor. You have two desks, two dressers, and a fairly large closet. The Brick is one of the most popular residence halls on campus. It was first built in 1858 and was ladies hall for the female students at the time. Now the Brick is co-educational. This building is rich with history, including being a World War II infirmary. Some of this history can be learned from the pictures hung on the walls in the common room on the first floor. This residence hall also has a kitchen, laundry room, stall bathrooms, and vending machines.